day two and I'm so ready. What's funny is I feel so much better about going today than I did yesterday, mainly because yesterday was my first day and I didn't know what to expect. Yesterday we got out early at about three o'clock, but <laughs> she was joking and saying, listen, I'm just letting you guys out because it's the first day. Them other days, it's gonna be dark outside and we're still gonna be here, which was so funny. Um, I, she was also telling us that, you know, it's three weeks, but, or is it four weeks? But it's gonna run off so quickly, which I know it is. It's currently 8.03. If I drove, it would literally take me 13 minutes to get there. I'm gonna leave at about 8.20. So it's 21 days and yesterday I did one. So we literally have like 20 days left. Well, 19 today. So um, that's dope. The instructor would prefer if there were no phones inside of her class, cause she don't want to, she don't want to hear that I'm bringing. Okay, which I get. That's so understandable. Um, and yesterday, after she said that, there was this guy, and man's just had his phone out. And then yesterday, one wanted to go to the restroom, and it was like in the middle of her talking, and he didn't even say nothing. He just got up and like walked out, and I'm like, wow. I couldn't do that. I'm trying to make sure that the back of my hair sits nicely. I made sure yesterday that I put my umbrella in my bag because freaking when I left yesterday, it was raining. And because I didn't have an umbrella, I had to Uber because I was not going to get caught in this rain girl. She said to do some reading on respiration, which I kind of did. But, um... Yeah, and we're going to have... A freaking test on Monday so hopefully we get some actual work today and tomorrow that we're gonna be able to transfer whatever we learn on these two three days pretty much too because yesterday we didn't really go over much on the test I need to bring a bottle of water we get one hour for lunch but we stay inside of the building or inside of the classroom I mean you could leave because yesterday I went outside and I was like kind of walking around because I already know the area from when I went to register, I had to walk up and down to find an ATM because they take the payments in cash only. So I'm kind of acclimated with the strip. Um, So yeah, but you can walk around, stretch your legs a little bit and not have to sit there for one hour. So I might do that today again too, but I need to bring water. So I have something to drink so I don't have to buy anything because yesterday I bought a drink. But I had a sandwich that I still didn't even eat. But um, yeah. Uh, that's pretty much all I have to say. I need to buy white shoes, but for now the black shoes works because she said, you know, it looks more uniformed if the shoes are white, but since the school told us that we could wear whatever color right now and for the clinicals we have to wear white, then everybody was working with that because everybody was in whatever color they felt like wearing, but I'm going to make it a point of my duty possibly this weekend to get white shoes, which is so crazy because I was actually gonna buy it. I'm like, yeah, they said for the clinicals, but what is it gonna hurt if I actually have it before? But then I was just like, you know what? If I don't have to buy it now, I'm not gonna buy it now, which is what I did. But now we're gonna actually need it. It's 8.07, I still have some time before I have to leave. Last night I paid some money on my credit card. Pretty long day today, but since there's going to be a test on Monday or Tuesday, I'm making sure that I prepare because the book has some, um, we're supposed to read up on chapters one through four. At the end of each chapter, there are some pretty much chapter review type questions where, you know, it asks you about what was going on in the paragraph. What I'm doing is I'm on my map book and I'm trying to prepare and answer all the questions and study from those. When I did this course before back in Jamaica, that's pretty much what I did except the book. I don't think it's had the questions. So I'm going through and I'm doing that right now.
guys right now it is 10 57 p.m see that 10 57 and i literally just got done with this shit so what i did was i she said to read chapters one through four and i did and then i went through and i printed i typed up the questions on my map book like you guys seen before and you know answer the questions and then print them out and then i'm gonna use these to study from what this will give me is like a better idea of what i'm studying than to just be reading through the whole book the whole book itself is intimidating because it is a super big book so i have to chop it down how my brain can best understand it no i will have you know that there are 24 chapters we have four weeks to complete this course and boy when i tell you that i guess i have 20 chapters left because i already went through four so what i'm gonna do is over the weekend i don't know how much i'm gonna get my camera was super disrespectful it just died which is crazy because i brought the battery knowing that that one was already dead but then when i turned it on it came on so over the weekend what i'm going to try to do is go through another four chapters or so and do some more questions type them up in my phone or my computer or something just when i have the time and print them out and do it like this so before you know it i'll have all the questions from inside of the book in here in a more complex form is it complex compressed format to where it's easier for me to study because we also have 22 skills that we have to learn along with the 24 chapters inside of this book i don't know if she's gonna go chapter by chapter through every chapter but it's not like she went inside of the book since the classes start this is day two tomorrow's day three and we're already getting a test on monday i have to make sure that i'm prepared because i need to pass this course so there is that so that's what i plan to do i'm also planning on doing some reading you know going through these questions getting acclimated with these um questions and the answers you know these answers look long as hell it is what it is i'm so loopy because i'm literally so tired it's 11 01 so tired so thirsty and so sleepy so i'm gonna plug my battery in right here pack the stuff back up inside of my bag because i have school tomorrow and then i'm gonna drink something and go to bed keep going i'm still doing that okay the good thing about tomorrow is going to be that after I come home, I'm not going to have to um, cook because tomorrow's Friday and the thing is going to be at Dwayne's um, uncle's. So we're going to go and really relax. So I'm going to like read through the pamphlet from like through the booklet from like I leave school to like the time that he gets home and stuff because right now I'm literally so tired and I go to school all day and then I come home in the evenings and I still make dinner and still do what needs to be done around that apartment and stuff like that so it's just like it's day two and it's already kicking my ass I need to get into the groove of things so it doesn't feel like that anyways I just turned the air conditioner on and I'm about to drink some water and go to bed